In this video, we will go through the steps for setting up your GigSky eSIM for mobile data on your Samsung phone. Please note the following steps are to be completed upon arriving at your destination for which you have bought a GigSky eSIM plan. First, launch the settings app on your phone. Here's the screen you will see once it is launched. Then, make sure that the GigSky eSIM has been turned on. To do so, tap on Connections. You will see a screen similar to this one. Tap on SIM Manager. You will see a screen similar to this one. You need to make sure that the GigSky eSIM has been turned on. Locate the GigSky eSIM from the list of eSIMs shown on the screen. Here is an example where the eSIM has been labeled as eSIM1 and is currently turned off. To turn it on, tap the toggle button next to the label. You will be asked to confirm if you want to turn on the eSIM. While it is turning on, you will see a screen similar to this one. If you are unsure if the right eSIM has been turned on, a good way to verify is by checking the ICCID number shown for the active SIM. Here's how to verify. First, launch the GigSky app. Then, navigate to the My Plan screen and locate your plan. The ICCID number of the required eSIM is shown against it. Here is an example of where to locate it. Please take note of the ICCID number shown against your plan. Now, launch the Settings app again. Tap on Connections. You will see a screen similar to this one. Tap on SIM Manager. You will see a screen similar to this one. Tap on the label of the eSIM that you just turned on. The label for the eSIM in this example is eSIM1. You will see a screen similar to this one. Tap on More Information. In the screen shown, look for the field with the label ICCID. If the value shown for this field matches what you had noted down previously from the GigSky app, then it means that the right GigSky eSIM has been selected. If the value of the ICCID number does not match what was expected, and if there are other eSIMs on the phone that you think could be a GigSky eSIM, you will need to repeat the steps of turning them on one by one and checking the ICCID number until you find the matching ICCID number. If you have exhausted trying all of the eSIMs, please reach out to GigSky customer support at help at gigsky.com. Once you have confirmed that the right GigSky eSIM has been turned on, it has to be selected as the SIM to be used for data. Launch the Settings app again. Tap on Connections. You will see a screen similar to this one. Tap on SIM Manager. In the screen shown, scroll down to the section Preferred SIMs. Then tap on Mobile Data. In the list shown, select the GigSky eSIM. The label for the eSIM in this example is eSIM1. You will then be asked to confirm the change of eSIMs. Tap on OK. Once the action has been completed, you will see a message similar to the one at the bottom of the screen. Here is how the SIM Manager screen will look once the selection has been completed. You should now be ready to use your GigSky plan. 
check to see if you're able to get a data connection on your phone. If you still aren't getting a data connection, please reach out to GigSky support at help at gigsky.com.